don't know. I don't, <laughs> I don't have time for anything. We've got a great togetherness. We wouldn't have got this far if we weren't as together as a team. It just shows when we play how much we're doing it for each other. We've played together, the majority of us, for the last 15, 20 years. We fight for each other in the field and we do anything for each other off it. We're the underdogs. Obviously that goes from uh, what we've done over the last two years. And coming into the tournament we've got no pressure on us so we can just go out and play and just show what we can do. We went against all odds to actually qualify for this tournament. We're really hard working. And we'll go out and we'll give everything, you know, every inch of our, our blood, sweat and tears. Sarah McFadden. Sarah Mack. She's just the, the rock of our team. She's our, our rock in the centre half. She's one of the best defenders um, I've ever played with and, and probably throughout Europe. I think the main one is Simone McGill. Simone McGill, she's always a goal threat. People don't realise how good she really is. Jolie Andrews, the up and coming um, young star. She's powerful, she's speed and she can get us up the pitch. I'm a mother, I've got a four-year-old daughter. I'm a mum, I get married at the end of the year. It's the reason why I play football every day still, to try and inspire her to play in the future. I'm a lifeguard. I'm a funeral director. I'm Scottish, I live in England, I play for Northern Ireland. And I've played for the same club for over 20 years. Create the new generation of girls that want to play football because none of us had that growing up. It's our first major tournament. That's one of the main things I'm looking forward to is us sharing that experience. Us being on the world stage and being part of something that we've never been part of in order to make memories as a squad. Just being out there in front of uh, fans, uh, especially like the numbers we seem to be getting in would be unbelievable. Having the, the green and white army follow us um, here from Northern Ireland over to England. And yeah, just showing what Northern Ireland is about as a nation. 